Hello everyone, welcome to Yellow Pages Nursing. In today's video, we will be discussing about IV fluid calculation where we will be discussing the rate of infusion that is how to set ml per hour, how to calculate total volume and total hours and also IV drip rate that is drops per minute or GTT per minute. Before entering into the session, if you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe our channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Let's get into the topic. Let's do calculation for rate of infusion that is ml per hour with the example 1. The physician has ordered D5 water 1000 milliliters in 10 hours. Calculate the rate of infusion in ml per hour. The formula to calculate ml per hour is equal to total infusion volume that is in ml divided by total infusion time in hours. Here total infusion volume in ml is 1000 and total infusion time in hours is 10. So applying in the formula we get 1000 ml divided by 10 hours which gives 100 ml per hour. Hence the rate of infusion will be 100 ml per hour. Let's do an example for calculating total volume. The physician has ordered D5 water 100 ml per hour IV for 12 hours. Find the total volume required for the infusion. Formula to calculate total volume is equal to rate of infusion multiplied by total infusion time in hours. Here, the rate of infusion is 100 ml per hour. Total infusion time in hours is 12. So, applying in the formula, we get 100 multiplied by 12, which gives 1200 ml. Hence, the total volume will be 1200 ml. Next, let's do calculation of total hours or duration with an example. The physician has ordered D5 water 1000 ml at a rate of 125 ml per hour. Find the total hours required for the infusion. Formula to calculate total hours is equal to total infusion volume in ml divided by rate of infusion ml per hour. Here, total infusion volume in ml is 1000. Rate of infusion is 125 ml per hour. Applying in the formula, we get 1000 divided by 125 which gives 8. And hence, the total hours or duration required for the infusion will be 8 hours. Next, calculation of IV drip rate in drops per minute or GTTS per minute. The example is, a patient is receiving 400 ml normal saline IV over 4 hours using tubing with a drip factor of 20 drops per ml. How many drops per minute should be delivered? The formula for calculating flow rate is equal to total infusion volume multiplied by drop factor divided by time in minutes which gives the drops per minute or GTTS per minute. Here total infusion volume is 400 ml, drop factor is 20 drops per ml, time in minutes will be 4 multiplied by 60. So applying in the formula, we get flow rate is equal to 400 multiplied by 20 divided by 4 multiplied by 60, which gives 33.3, .3, that is 33 drops per minute. Remember that drops are always rounded to the nearest whole number. For the same example, if we require ml per hour, then the formula is total infusion volume divided by total infusion time that is 400 divided by 4 which gives 100 ml per hour. In case of maintaining hourly intake output chart, this formula is very useful to calculate the hourly intake that is ml per hour. One more example for calculating IV drip rate. A patient is receiving 300 ml normal saline IV over 5 hours using tubing with a micro drip set of 60 drops per ml. How many drops per minute should be delivered? The formula to calculate flow rate is equal to total infusion volume multiplied by drop factor divided by time in minutes which gives drops per minute. Here total infusion volume is 300 ml, drop factor is 60 drops per ml, time in minutes will be 5 multiplied by 60. 
So applying in the formula we get flow rate is equal to 300 multiplied by 60 divided by 5 multiplied by 60 which gives 60 drops per minute. In order to calculate ml per hour the formula is total infusion volume divided by total infusion time that is 300 divided by 5 which gives 60 ml per hour. We also have videos explaining IV rate calculation using simple techniques. The link is given in the description below. If you find this video useful, please like it, share it and subscribe it and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.